what's going on guys uh before i get into today's video i just want to give a shout out and big thanks to everyone that watched uh the first couple of videos and subscribed to the channel uh, all the support really does mean a lot and you know obviously it helps grow the channel it gives me motivation to continue making videos and continue to bring out content uh, but as you can tell by the title of the video i've got a new project to the channel i've been looking for a car for a while now since this pharaoh is almost done looking for something obviously to to do after. Goal of this car is to basically film the whole thing from the ground up, something that I wish I could have done with the Sephira but just never did. Uh, so I picked up this car uh, a couple days ago now actually, picked it up for a real good price. It's already had a few things done to it, it's a little bit rough on the outside but it's definitely perfect for what I want. The Sephira is a lot tidier, it's very straight, it's not really a car that I want to go out and thrash, it's more of a car that I just want to you know sort of enjoy and cruise. So yeah I've been looking for a car to definitely build up, build a lot more crazier than the Severo is. So I've got some big plans for it. So what it is, is it is a 1991 Nissan Skyline uh, GDS R32. Bit dirty at the moment. Um, we took it out last night on some private roads which I'll put in uh, in the video in a, uh, shortly. It's got five stud and big brakes off a R32 GDST. The interior is really tidy for a you know R32. Most interiors um, are usually pretty a lot more wrecked, missing vents and things like that. And I've had a gold Skyline, which you guys have seen briefly in like a little introduction clip that I put a, uh, that I put the beginning of the first two videos. So this car is essentially similar to that, except you know obviously five stud, big brakes. It's a 20E. But yeah, I've got some big plans for it. But it does have a RB20 deck gearbox. It's got a puck clutch in it. I'm not entirely sure if it's a five puck or a six puck, but the clutch and gearbox in this car is actually better than the gearbox and clutches in my Sephira. If thing rips hard for a 20, it goes a hell of a lot better than my, uh, my old Skyline does. But the plans for this is to definitely make it a lot crazier than the Sephira is. So this is definitely going to be a thrash car probably going to be taking it to track days and things like that and actually properly learn how to drift. So what I'm going to be doing is we're going to be getting a 25 debt. Probably going to be looking at getting like a Series 2 or a Neo and doing a front facing plenum, big injectors, top mount, big turbo, probably going to put an AR70 or something like that on it. External gate, screamer pipe and um, yeah. I would love to get like a Link ECU or something like that, but possibly may go with a Niztune, just depends on how much I can, you know, save and and all that, because all that is going to be very expensive. But the goal for this car is to make about 300 kilowatt, about four, which is about 400 horsepower. It's quite funny, um, we're actually going to be towing uh, a mate's Hilux that uh, he drowned uh, probably over a little over a month ago. We're actually going to be towing it from one mate's house back to his house with the skidder and then I'll cut to clips of last night. The thing that Skyline's good for that most people don't know, they make fucking real good tow vehicles. Look at that. Towing a dead Hilux. Piece of piss. Oh, she's doing fucking mean. here in one piece.
死！The uh, the 20 egg goes pretty well, and uh, this is the the aftermath. These tyres were pretty much brand new, and we put them on last night. One side's completely ballooned up. It's on the wires, bands everywhere. It's just shedded chunks off this one. Perfect. It's gonna be real cool once we get the surf done and get that out. We were on a private road uh, way down in the South Island, out the way of anyone. No one was around, so keep it off the streets, kids. I'm really excited about this build. It's probably gonna take a few months for me to be able to save the money and um, get all the parts together to work on the car. Safiro is really close to being done, so once that is done, we'll be bringing out plenty of videos on that. Definitely am excited for this build. It's gonna be pretty epic and it's definitely gonna be really nuts once it's done. Like, subscribe, comment, and uh, yeah, keep an eye out for the videos and yeah, thanks.